Hello, and welcome back to my playthrough of Shining in the Darkness. And in this episode, I will be going back through level 3, but this time I won't be stopping at the Shell Beast, because now it's been defeated, I can go and explore the rest of level 3 of the Labyrinth proper, and I'll try and make it to the end of the floor where you get the boss, and then once I can actually see the fountain and can get to it, I know I am high enough level and good enough to get there and risk taking the other half of the medallion out. Anyway, without further ado, time to get into it. And speaking of that, let me just see if this is... There we go. It's done now. Speaking of medallion... Do, 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 Oh yeah, and before I carry on, just so you see, lovely, he's now got the mithril armour, giving him the magic shield, he's got the steel helm, and the uh, great lance, he's got a hammer, The they've both got the light equipment, she's got the hex whip, the shield, I got an elven hood for him, and a magic hood, well, she's kept the magic hood, anyway, um, I managed to actually level up quite quickly, because I found basically a gold mine, um, around, around this area somewhere, uh, once I got the mystic rope, because I wanted to get that off there, I went up into the fourth floor early, in one of the areas you can go to, oh no, thank god, um, early, and basically, um, I originally got destroyed by the enemies up there, because I think of that, I think they were like, really late, four floor enemies that you get right near the end and um, yeah it didn't um, didn't end too well uh, so you know anyway but then eventually I started getting experience got zombies four of them were enough to give you 5,000 experience like uh, but they were dealing like 40 50 damage each but because it doesn't take long to get to that area um, I could afford to just waste time. Anyway, I always do that. Anyway, I think this is the third time I've been down this area. The second time was when I did it on here because I went there once before then. Because um, I was planning on finding my way to the second boss, but then I found that area and just thought I'd grind up quick. Because I think Spike, I think they were all on three levels under this, I think. Weren't they? I think Milo was 29, Pyra was 30, and Spike was 31. I mean, Pyra might go up soon, innit? Oh, here we go. Sp sea Stallion. Whatever, mate. And then there's four opportunities for this silly little battle. Got one of them, good. Didn't want any more than that. To the right is a cage with a chest in it, you have to go around to get to it. Anyway, I always do that with those bloody fountains. Anyway, oh no. Well, you know what I'm doing. I'm not risking that. No way. Jose. No way. Jose. Because level 1 D soul has probably got a really high chance of doing it. Oh yeah, you get um, enemies as well. You get, well, I mean, you get stronger versions of these. And you get uh, Mandragoras, which are stronger versions of Mandrakes. They howl in pain, and it hits all three of them, and, well, basically, if it hits them, they die, so you could get instant game over if all three of them get killed by one howl. And if there's multiple of them, that's going to be multiple howls. Anyway, I can't believe it, though. Like, my own minions are turning against me. Phantom's minions are turning against him. Anyway, I don't know if that's enough damage for Milo to capitalise. He chose the wrong one. But Spike is still fast enough to go. How much damage? Not too bad. Not too bad. I mean, once Spike gets the um, arms of light, I'll probably give Milo the Mithril uh, armour. Because I didn't realise that it actually is much better than the magic robe, whatever it's called. But it is. It's much better. Anyway, oh my god, three of these. Blood deal. Falling into you, baby. I decided to as well look at the um, level that other YouTubers are on at this point. 
when they did it, Spike was, uh, well, whatever their main character was, was 33. So I'm like a level above, which is fine, you know, a level isn't too much. They had a bit better equipment. I don't know how, because I've got a maximum of three Mithril so far. I mean, I've, I've got one on me. I've kept it, but you know, yeah. So many turns in this dungeon. And oh god. Come on, nobody needs to miss. Oh no, what have I done? I've wasted. Oh no. This is what happens when you misclick, ladies and gentlemen. This is what happens when you misclick. I have boned myself. <sighs> oh no, 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 that's not good. Right, come on, don't do the same bloody thing this time. There we go, down you go. I can't believe bloody spike missed. Oh god. Let's not do that again, please. I mean, Mad Tut used to do like oh, 40 damage odd, so that's that is much better, you know. Anyway, if Milo attacks Camille, Spike can attack the Mad Tut. Or t yeah, I'm guessing or Toot because it's like Toot and Carmoon, you know. Anyway, I mean, 1460 is still some good experience, you know. Anyway. Yeah, I did it in the morning before I went out to do what I usually do on Saturdays. I think I spent about two hours doing it, I think. About that. And then the last, like, 45 minutes to an hour was me spending time doing the fourth floor stuff. I'm guessing going in areas like that is how you get arms of light as well. Which would actually be very bloody annoying, but you know, anyway. Oh, wow. A bit of unnecessary damage, but whatever. Uh, is there any need? Like, look, you're, you're so weak when you're when you're without your brothers slash sisters, you know. Anyway, oh my God, Milo's showing off. Unless he's trying to impress Pyra, he might be. Or Spike, depends what way he swings. Oh, one Grim Spectre. I should be able to just do this as long as nobody misses. Good. I didn't eat my own words. Nom, 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 nom. Eating my own words can be very tasty, but you know, I'd rather not. Oh yeah, you get you get good gold as well from the enemies on the fourth floor. So sometimes gold is a bit weak um, with this, but you know, it weren't too bad actually. Oh no, some wing blades. <laughs> Two of them should be able to be defeated because I think Spike can go before them now. Because the trick is, once Spike can start outspeeding the majority of enemies, you should be fine to just go through it. And so you waste your time like that. 12 damage, that is much better. You know, I'm getting there slowly. You know, the hardest thing will probably be getting the arms of light, but I need to just try and get them, you know. If I can get them, then that'll be amazing, but you know. Do, 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 do. Oh, bugger it off. Bugger it off. Right, one should be able to get the feet there. I'm relying on Spike to go first. Thank you. That's a bloody risk that I don't really want to take. Whatever. Do, 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 do. Oh, bloody hell, not again. Stop with the Grim Spectres, man. Come on. You're baiting me in, you're just going to chuck in like five at once soon. And I'm going to have to waste MP on them. I don't want that. Because they're likely to use D-Soul, because that's what they bloody do. Do, do, do. I'm going to save it. Anyway, I believe right there was where I had that trouble with the other ones, right? I think it was, I remember. Very well. I mean, this is only the second time I think I've... Well, no, third time I've come out this far. Um, but I can still remember it quite well. Um... I mean, the second floor I can remember very, very well, but you know, anyway, I don't think he's going to be able to outspeed the Tommy Hawk. Nah, they're too fast. Doo -doo. Oh, what have you done? What are you doing, eh? 
What's I doing? Anyways, it's good to see Pyra tanking hits. Milo's back to being the weak one again. <laughs> anyway, lovely. Nice one, Pyra. I would clap, but I've kind of got control in my hand. Oh, well, uh, lovely. One step. Yeah, I've noticed, like, they like to miss a lot. Like, like they're missing more frequently. Um, which isn't good, because the enemies are really strong. But anyway. There's where Shell Beast was. Anyway, well, of course I'm prioritising against the Hell Knights. Like, duh. Anyway, there's a good chance one of them will miss because Hell Knights aren't easily defeated. You anyway, know that that, equi that equivocates to 69 health. Lol, so funny. Six damage to Pyra. Hmm. Ah, you son of a bitch! I was hoping you wouldn't use that. Let's just get rid of you first. Lightning can't strike twice, can it? And Death Serpent ain't gonna, you know, use that again. Can it even use moves like that multiple times, like the same one? I don't know. I don't think it can. Anyway, lovely. I didn't realise he's actually that close to levelling up. Oh, they went up the same time. That's rare. Well, level 2 boost is pointless, but whatever. Bloody hell, it's quite far into the dungeon with uh, an encounter. I mean, if I don't get too many encounters, that, that that's great, you know. I don't need to worry, you know. That's fine. Anyway. Oh, I see. That's what I went. Anyway, look, there's still quite a bit that... I still went, like, across here. Blah, blah, blah. I mean, for a game in 1991, music... Oh, ugh. amazing, mate. Amazing. Anyway, oh, bloody hell. I just want to make sure, you know... Right, it was down. Anyway, look at that mess. That's the start of the dungeon. That's it. That's where, um... The thing was, so if you start there, the hole's there, that's that massive room anyway. Oh, bloody hell. What is this? Go on, crit one, you've got... You've got 20% chance, surely. Oh, no, that's the opposite, man. That's the opposite. I'm hoping spike attacks number four, the one that didn't get hit. Anyway, that's it, you run. There we go, thank you, they're being nice to me. Actually doing what I want them to do. And they're 18 damage. Oh, Milo, Milo, Milo. Oh, shouldn't be getting that much dealt to you, mate. That's a bit too much. Nah, it's fine. Imagine getting through here with ease, and I don't like it because I shouldn't be getting through with ease. I bet as soon as I take the medallion out, I get boned over, and there's going to be like crap tons of grim specters, all that stuff. But I want to take out the boss and actually physically see the gold. Uh, fountain first. Oh, again. Whatever. It's fine. Crit one this time. Come on. You know you want me. I know I want you. You know you want me. You know I want you. Come on. Attack before. Never mind. I mean, some of them will attack before, some of them won't. But anyway, Spike's only taking eight. That's promising. The Mithril armor really is helpful. Anyway. Did Spike attack one of the ones that didn't attack already? I don't know. Anyway. It's one of the rare occasions where Pyra gets two attacks before she gets tangled. I think I've had one occasion where she had three attacks before she was tangled. I think so. I could be wrong though. But anyway. Oh, bugger it all for a game of toy soldiers. Crit, 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 crit. Oh. Right, at least you aim for the right one. Bloody hell. Right, it's going to be some disgusting damage. Actually, no, that's not too bad. That's not too bad. Spike has become a tank, and I like it. You know, 
Oh, tank-ish. And then you get Milo. And then 24 though again. Not too bad. Not too bad. Anyway, I'm, I'm, I don't know. I'm, I feel like once I get the medallion, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to slightly get a bit scared. I don't know. I just don't trust this game. And I feel like I'm going to get the most awful encounters. Hopefully I don't know, but you know. There's a very high chance that I could. Oh, what are you doing? Oh, here we go, look. Living dead. I mean, I've seen the stronger version of the zombie, but you know. Yeah, I'm not dealing with that. Oh, why are you doing this now? I've bloody decided... Oh, yeah, I see. You do that when I bloody use a magic. Of course you do. Anyway, he shouldn't go before me, I don't think. I don't know. I don't think he will. No. I know you get trolls, I think, as well, down here. Anyway. I mean, I mean, you'll probably be seeing me play quite differently when it comes to... Um, thing. Anyway, bloody hell, I did go quite far, didn't I? Did I really go this far? Did I re This was... This was... I carried on from when I, um... Defeated the Shell Beast. When I ended it, I carried on from there. Anyway, ah, oh, yeah. There, that's where you get the Mystic Rope. And it... Oh, bloody hell. What to attack? Battle Oaks. I'm sorry. Battle Oaks. Oh, Pyra. You are making me a happy person. My friend. Great damage. Anyway. Good. Good. There's no point attacking Pyra, mate. No point attacking. There's a reason why I've made her have the rock solid defence, you son of a bitch. Because my my style of play is why worry too much about the defence if you can kill them quick. That was originally what it is, but now I do have to balance it out. Like there's no way you can do this without balancing out. Anyway. She always breaks out when it's too, when it's too late, and that was an unnecessary crit. But whatever, good experience though. Good experience. Oh God, where do I go from here? I think I can make it, can't I? Straight to the bit, sort of like winding in and out of bits. I think so, maybe. No, it's a good thing I bloody save stated it. That's just a trolley area. I don't think I took that trolley over before, but you know, whatever. What? This didn't happen before. Oh crap. Oh no. What is this? I never knew this. Oh, you see, I got nice. I got so lucky, clearly. What is this? Oh, Jesus, that's not too bad, actually. Anyway, time to go. Oh, that missed. And she gets tangled anyway. Of course she does, anyway. Oh, well done. You're so amazing. Oh, no. Oh. That's like the original salamander attack. Ay, 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 ay. Ooh la la. Come on, go before it. Oh, you idiot. Nah, I'm gonna have to restart that battle, I'm afraid. Ha, <laughs> you see? Bloody hell, that battle. Ooh. That battle, man. I never realised. I just. I, I should have thought that maybe they'd add another Kaiser Crab type enemy. But you know, yeah. Oh. Ugh, that's dirty. That's, that's disgusting. I mean, ev everybody's missing the stupid thing and all. I guess I could try and go for a slow with Pyra. Maybe that'll work. Ooh, I don't know. Oh, bugger it all for a game of toy soldiers, man. Ah, let's go for it. YOLO! Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Bam, come on. Yeah. 
See, look, two different styles of play. Which one wins? Much less MP used that way. Now I only need to heal up one teeny weeny bit. Bloody hell, I went around wrong long way, didn't I? And yeah, I think the the bit where it stops is where I um went up to one of those things so I got to enemies on the full floor and I dropped down and I think I found I think it's called Enduro Staff. Yes, it's called Enduro Staff. You know, I've already looted. I hope you don't mind me doing that off here, but you know, I've kind of got a prior ties. Anyway, one thing I didn't see in the level four was a like stronger version of these night enemies. I'm guessing you do get them, but you know, 21. But you know, expect that. Anyway, I'll make them both attack Tommy Hawk in case Milo misses again. He didn't know, which is good. He should be able to. Wait, what? Oh, Pyra missed originally as well. Oh my god! Holy mother of Nazareth. Oh, you're an idiot. Now is not the time to miss. You see that miss after miss after miss. And then she struggles free at the wrong times, man. I'm sure they do it on purpose. I really am sure they do it on purpose. And anyway, that was just unlucky. I've got a feeling I've got to the point now, though, where MP is going to be used very, very quickly. And you know, a living dead again. Here we go. Oh, they've got good defence. There we go. That'll do. That'll do. I don't think they can do too much, can they? Oh, wow. They're not that much weaker than the other versions. Bloody hell. I don't want to waste, like, MP and stuff. There's no need for that. Because, I mean, it'll be cheaper to just, you know, yeah. Actually, no, I think you've got those bloody... Yeah, you've got the things here, anyway. What is that? Oh, yes. I think I took the thing there and I came out here, went there, grabbed the chest. Because there's a cage, like, there. I don't know what that is, but you know. And now this is a similar layout to near the end of level two. Obviously, you have sentinels to the side, but you know. Once this battle's done, I will go to. Well, probably straight down. I'm not sure though. Anyway, to be fair, I haven't used too much um, MP. Oh, you're an idiot. Why miss after miss after miss after miss after miss? Stop it, man. Because this happens. We don't want this crap happening because that happens. And that is not what's best for business, is it? She struggled free at least, but you know, I don't think it's going to matter. Our spike went first, that's good. Just don't crit Milo. Why would I say that? Never mind, it used that crappy move anyway. Come on, Milo and Pyra have got a good chance of attacking. Come on. There we go. <sighs> this is just unlucky. Like, if they stop missing, I should, I might be fine. Anyway, yep, I thought I'd just do the full heal. You know, heal level 3 is only good once you get over, like, 160 plus health. Because otherwise, uh, two level 2 heals are still, like, good enough. Right, this is where I got to, and that's it. From here on in, unfamiliar territory. And of course, this time Pyla Pyra doesn't get tangled up in the whip. And does it matter? No, because she didn't miss. God, this game loves to be annoying sometimes. It really does. Like, it really does. Do 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 do
Oh yeah, of course. Oh yeah, um, what they called blood. Yeah, here we go. Blood rooster. They can like make bloodshot eyes or something. I don't know, something like that. It was weird, and I was like, oh no, that don't sound good. It looks like it's an attack that can like attack absolutely anybody. And anyway, come on, Milo. If you miss, I will, I will make you a physical person and punch you in the face for the sake of it. Anyway, how much experience per blood rooster? 560. Mm, that's not too bad, but as you can see, like, the the EXP to gold ratio is dreadful. But the EXP to gold ratio in level 4, at least the enemies I was facing there, is magnificent. Oh, yeah, of course. Oh, here we go. Here's the trolls. Is that mad tut? Yep. I don't know what to attack, to be fair, but anyway. Let's attack you, bitches. Down you go. Yes, he went for the mad tut. That's good. Troll time. 34, blood deal. That's some good damage. That's some good damage. And, you know, it's fair, fair enough. It's good damage, you know. It's got, oh, it's got good defence as well. Ugh. It's just Milo's weapons. He can get better still. That's the problem. Anyway, I still ain't found any of the arms of light. And it's going to start getting to a worrying stage, like, very soon. Because I feel like it'd be very important to get him anyway. Is this... Aha! Orb of Truth time. Anyway, this is going to be a... Str I'm guessing this is going to be a stronger Grimoire. If it isn't, then that'll be weird anyway. That's definitely a different sound. Let me just see what happens if I, you know, do this. I'm guessing it's going to be... Um stronger or maybe it isn't 150 experience whoop whoop is it worth it though we'll see ice stuff can he equip stuff though I don't know I think he can no only pyra can but I'm not really bothered about that. Oh, are you kidding me? I've never come this far out, so you know. Yeah. Right, so I'll boost first. And then I will go for a lovely little, you know, slow. Um, what's it called? Scissor. And then hopefully I can, you know, go for a skeet, skeet, bang, bang. That's it. Keep on attacking Spike. That's fine. Falling into you, baby. Yes, good. It's two out of two it's worked. Thank you. Lovely. Come on, crit. Oh, I want you to make up for your stupid mistakes. Because what a stupid mistake to make for such a stupid idiot. Anyway, that's some damage, though. Blood deal. Oh. I hope the next boss don't do that, because I know there is another boss here. I'm just going to wait for it anyway. 28 minutes. Hmm. I don't know how much is left, but I know that, like, for half of the map going down, just, like, doing that weird spirally movement, and I'm guessing this, this half of the map here is probably quite... has been filled up quite a bit as well. So I don't think there's too much left. Hopefully not, because if there is still things left, then, oh, God. <laughs> Gonna cry. Oh, hello. What's that? That don't look very good, anyway. It's starting to get on my nerves now. It's getting too much now. Well done, Spike. You hit this time, aren't you? Amazing. I think it does only get one attack, though, which is amazing anyway. Oh, yes. Three out of three. Ain't bad. Anyway, come on, don't miss now. Thank you. 
Good, 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 good. See, I was right about MP just slowly going down like that. Anyway, it's fine. So long, farewell. Off it does in good night. So long. And then what's the time? I would make that if this is 45 minutes behind half past eight. Hmm. Well then. I'll bugger it all for a game of toy soldiers. Is it worth it? I don't bloody know. Oh, this is this is where it gets a bit um iffy wiffy sticky sticky wah wah. Anyway, I'm guessing this is the right way to go. Please be the right way to go. Don't lead me down a stray path, please. Right, no encounters, good. I bet when when I come with the medallion, I'll get an encounter there, though. That's a normal wall. Oh my bloody god, here we go. Demonica, oh, I remember these idiots. You're getting boasted, bitch! Look at that defence, oh, Ugh, too much defence, man. Don't like it. Just defeat him, please. Thank you. Very much appreciated. Oh, that's not appreciated. That's not appreciated. Ugh. It's going to have two attacks. It's going to have two attacks. Oh, no, maybe not now. It did originally, though. Anyway, this part of the dungeon is going to be that part that makes me wonder... Oh, my God. Yeah, this is going to be that type of dungeon. This this part, I'm like, ooh, should I take the medallion or not yet? Ugh. I might just have to do two bloody Fire Red videos. I, I don't want to risk it, you know? I really don't want to risk it. Right, that's a dead end over there. Here's some more crap monikers. I mean, demonikers, sorry. Sorry, not sorry. Come on, Milo, do enough damage. Yes, nice one. That's fine, whatever. Deal with it, bitch. There we go, there's the two attacks I was waiting for. These are the type of... Well, you get worse than this in that area, but, you know, anyway. I've got to be close to the boss. How much of the map is bloody left? Not even much. Not even much. Oh, hang on. I think this is where the boss is. I'm... Oh, no, no, no. I've, I've, I've seen the boss. It's a, it's a skeleton. He, cut, he comes out of the ground randomly. Um, like, when you least expect it. So you, you're likely not going to be prepared for it. Oh, crap. Is it here? No, but it'll be here somewhere. Here he is. Blackbone. Oh, God. This should be fun. Oh. I think this will be it, though, once I've... No, I will take the medallion next time, then. I, I am... I'm, I'm fine. I'll be fine to do it. I should be, anyway. <laughs> Oh, mummy, mummy, save me, mummy, save me. Ay, ay, ay. No, me gusta, no. No, me gusta. No, me gusta, no, 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 no. No, that is too much. No, 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 no. What are you doing, you stupid bitch? Look what you have done. Look what you have done. By missing, you stupid cretting. Do you know what? Stuff this. Let's just go for two attacks by Milo and Spike. Bam. Dead. Right, let's start this again. Let's start this again. Let's start this again. Deep breaths. <laughs> Right. Again. 
Oh crap, this isn't it. Oh, I didn't save it again, did I? Or did I? Oh no, I didn't. Mm. Not here, not here. Here. Right, let's try this again, shall we? Yes, we shall. We shall defeat the mighty. Let's go for one quick. And then boost. Bam, bada, bam, bam, bam. There's no point going for the slow. It's not going to work. I might as well just... Like, just, you know, make them speedy Gonzales and then go for it. And then I can, you know, rock up Milo's thing. Oh, you're an idiot. This is the one thing you don't want happening. You stupid idiot. I'm going to go for it again. Right. Come on. Don't be a douchebag. Hit the bloody boss, you moron. Thank you. That's 200 odd uh, health chopped off of it. Right, good. It distributed the damage. I'm going to have to go for heals again, but that's fine. He doesn't go before Milo. So it's fine. Right, here we go again. Bam. Yeah! That's what I'm talking about, bitch. Oof! Lovely experience. Anyway, that's boss five down. Blackbone. Yes, there it is. The gold fountain. Bloody found it. Anyway. Oh, this is where it gets fun. This is where it gets real fun. I'm hoping in terms of arms of light, there are two up here until two in floor five. Otherwise, I'm buggered. We'll see, though. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. Let's just have one battle in here just to see what it's like. Because I feel like we're all intrigued, aren't we? To find out what this is going to be like. I've never done this any... Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Does that paralyze? I don't know. Like, you get that with... Oh, no. <laughs> oh, dearie me. Oh, amazing! Oh. Well done, you were hit. Well, oh. Aren't you bloody amazing? I mean, maybe the magic shield pre prevents stuff like that. I have no idea anyway. You see, Milo needs a weapon like that. He needs the ultimate weapon. Come on. There we go. That's what we want. How much experience for them two? Oh, pretty good, pretty good. I mean, this isn't the um, amazing part uh, that I saw, but, you know, it's better than nothing. Anyway, yeah, it's, there's already so many different ways to go. It's unbelievable. Oh, what's this? Warbird. Oh. This looks amazing and all. Yeah, Milo needs such a better weapon. I mean, well, looks like need better defensive stuff and all. Otherwise, we are royally screwed. Diddly do, diddly do, diddly do, do. What a waste of time that was. Anyway, oh, here we go again, look, the Monica. What a waste of turn this was. That's much better, right. Attack again. Falling into you. Baby. Well done, you attacked the same one again. You did a smart move. Well done to ye. 
So yeah, that area there, that's um, an area I was in there. This is in the shape of a key. Quite ironic, really, isn't it? Oh, what are on earth are these? Right, yeah, I recognise the griffin, but bloody hell. What are these? <laughs> oh, no. I am screwed. Like, this floor is going to be ridiculous. I can already see it. I mean, when enemies look big like that, you've, you've got to think about what on earth it's going to be like. But that weren't too bad, but that's because I used a bloody burst, but you know. Oh, oh yes. See, this place is going to be a gold mine for experience, but I ain't doing that yet. But anyway. No, oh, there's a bloody troll again. I just want to get down to the end of this alleyway, just in case, you know. Ho 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 ho. Nah. Don't think there's really anything there, so. Without further ado, it's time to save it and exit and see if there's anything in the castle for me. We will see. It probably won't be. I have no idea, though. I've never made it here, and I'm bloody excited. His Majesty has been waiting for you. Oh, here we go. Tell me, Spike. My dear King Drake, I'm sorry that you persist on staying. Since you won't give me the realm, I'll just have to resort to violence. Melville, we meet again. Well, if it isn't my muddled mentor, what fool's errands bring you here, feeble one? I've come to put an end to your evil once and for all. Face me, Melville, or shall I call you Dark Soul? Is that the best you can do, old man? Then have a taste of this. Ha! The old dog runs away with his tail between his legs. What are you going to do, Drake, now that your champion is gone? Answer me, King, or do you still dare to hope? Could it be that you have yet another champion? Perhaps the son of my dear Mortred. Well then, let me make him an offer. Boy, would you like to join me? I don't think so. Well then, let's settle this once and for all. Meet me in the labyrinth and I'll prove how hopeless things are. Well, that's how you know we're getting close to the end, but anyway. Is there any hope of saving my daughter or my kingdom? Anyway, that does well at the end of this episode. So, thank you for watching this episode of my playthrough of Shining in the Darkness. I'm going to have to quickly make this, get this done. And in the next episode, I will go back through level 3 in order to place in the medallion. But until then, with a massive thumbs up, all I've got to say to you now is goodbye and good night.